Flash Clinic with PhotoQuest Adventures. Right now we're in Brooklyn Bridge Park. You can see the bridge. We have the East River, the city skyline back there. It's a fabulous location for working with speed lights and larger flash systems. Today we've been out here with a bunch of different models out here on the rocks. These flash workshops were designed to show complete beginners and intermediate users how to take their flash photography to the next level. We start very simple, single speed light, one reflector, work on qualities of light and how to work with that system, and we'll build into more advanced lighting setups for those who are interested in that. We have a whole bunch of gear on these workshops from Ellen Chrome, Last Delight, Manfrotto. We have reflectors, tri grips, overhead silks, a variety of soft boxes, including the six and a half foot Octabox. So if you've ever wondered what it's like to use one of those giant lights, we use those on these flash classes. We have Ellen Chrome Rangers and Quadras that they're battery operated, so we can use them anywhere we want on location, like out here on the river. We teach these flash workshops all across the country. We're in Santa Barbara, Las Vegas, Miami, Jackson, Wyoming, Moab, Utah, New York City. We work with a bunch of different models on these classes. A lot of people have never actually worked with real models before and it, it's a really fun part of these classes because depending on our location, we might hire cowboys, we might hire Elvis, showgirls, it just depends on where we're at. We go through talking about posing and working with talent. What are you going to learn on these flash classes? We're going to teach you a variety of different skills. We're going to start with one light speed light portraits. We're going to show you strategies that will allow you to get quick, good portraits using just one simple TTL light. We're going to talk about lighting ratio between your speed light and the available ambient light. We're going to show you how to cover a moving event like a wedding. We're going to also show you more advanced techniques using the battery powered pack. We'll show you simple, large, soft setups and then we'll also look at two and three light setups. You're going to come away with a lot of different strategies on how to use strobe from a simple TTL flash to multiple flash setups. You're really going to have a good time. You're definitely going to pick up some new strategies on using strobe and you're going to come away with some really nice images at the end of the weekend.